Hey guys, Geordie here and welcome back to Cutting the Crap. Today we're going to be taking a trip down memory lane and discussing all my top list of toys that were banned from your primary school if you were born in the 90s. But before we get into the video, don't forget to hit the like button and the subscribe button so that we can keep things going. That will be awesome and thank you for all your support so far. Obviously not everything is going to make the list, so feel free if there's anything that was banned from your school, write it in the comments below. The first toy to make the list isn't a new toy, but a company called Yomega re-released the yo-yo and it took our school by storm. Not only did we have groups coming out to the school to show us their new tricks and new toy things that they could do with the yo-yo, but everybody in school ended up buying one and nobody concentrated on school anymore. It was just who could do the coolest things with the yo-yo. So have a look at the ad. It brings back a lot of memories for me and I hope it does the same for you. It's a big world. You wanna do big tricks? Yo! Grab a Yomega yo-yo and yo big! Do it! You'll make a fireball has a special transaction for a super spin. Spin it! Raider rocks! The ball bearing spins longer and faster for big tricks! Trick it! The brain snaps back on its own, so you look like a genius. The brain, fireball, and Raider! These ain't your daddy's yo-yos. Yo big! Each sold simply. The next toy on our list is something that I'm sure everyone remembers, but if I was to ask you what toys were banned from your school, you wouldn't quite remember on the spot. So if anybody remembers Crazy Bones, these toys were little collectible plastic things that you had different designs and different names for the characters on them, and you play a game that was kind of like throwing them all at each other. So here's the ad for this one. Enjoy. You got your bones ready, a friend with bones too. So play those crazy bones, that's what you gotta do. Kids go crazy for crazy bones. The collectible, tradable, playable new craze. But crazy bones play seven different games, like battle and over the line. Each one has a name like Eggy, Fly, Frankie, Joker, and the Fang. Get your shooters, get your targets, play for fun. Just play those crazy bones on the playground in the streets. Series one now available for a limited time. Each sold separately from Playtoy. I hope that commercial brought back some memories. So we don't have this video go on for too much longer. I've only got three more to go. So the next one is something that I'm pretty sure everyone remembers. There was so many things on television about it. There was TV shows, cartoons, and I'm sure everybody that's watching this video, if you were born in the early to mid 90s, you were probably one of the people that got involved in this and your teacher definitely didn't like the people that would make the little boxes take them to school you rip it so enjoy the the next commercial guys Every journey begins with one step Every turn of the prize you come equipped Count down the letter it This is where my Beyblade battle begins I've practiced Prepared Battled at BeybladeBattles.com Skills make them wanna quit. Best believe I'm set to win. If you testing me, you better think again. Let it rip. Now I'ma let it hit. I'ma come with them with skills, make them wanna quit. I knew it was all leading to this. Beyblade Metal Fusion. Tops and stadiums each sold separately. Ask permission before going online. Download this music track free for a limited time only at BeybladeBattles.com. Beyblade, let it rip. 
Who would have thought that putting a zippy tie through a round piece of plastic would take off so big? I guess making a really sick ad that made you feel like you're a gangster in the underground battling other people with a Beyblade would be so awesome. So the next video that we're going to be discussing or viewing today is something that I'm pretty sure every single person out there had. These were the first kind of virtual pets that not only could you feed it, train it, battle it with your friends, but you could also clean up its shit, which made it super exciting. This thing had so many TV shows, movies, toys. It was probably the second biggest craze to ever happen through the 90s. Now, if you didn't have a Digimon, your parents obviously didn't love you, and I feel very sorry for you. But nevertheless, here is the ad, and I hope you enjoy. Digimon. New monsters, can't you see? Digital reality. Your teacher needs to fight. So train him day and night. Prepare to Digimon. And face your bow direct when you battle. Connect. So let the fight begin. And may the best beast win. Prepare to Digimon. Prepare to Digimon. The fight goes on and on. Prepare to Digimon. Digimon, the battling digital monster, eats so separately from Bandai. Now if that ad doesn't make you want to go through your old stuff and try and find your old Digimon, then I'm the only one in the world, obviously. But this is the moment we've all been waiting for. Number one. Now this trend has probably taken off more than anything else ever in the world. There has been more apps created, more games, more TV shows, more movies, and more merchandise than any other thing that has ever existed. So, if this doesn't bring back some memories, then you obviously didn't go to school. Um, so, enjoy Pokemon cards. Some original Pokemon cards that still exist around today fetch upwards of thousands of dollars. These toys can probably set you up for retirement early on in your life if you still have them. So, I hope you enjoy the commercial. Here it is. Ultimate Pokemon Master Trainer! Yes, I think I am! Then join the Pokemon Trading Card Game League! You'll do awesome activities! Learn wicked strategies, earn killer badges, and meet new friends as you begin your journey to become a Pokemon Master Trainer! To find out more about the Pokemon Trading Card Game League, log on to wizards.com! Go forth and be a master! I hope you enjoyed our trip going down memory lane with me today. If there's anything that you remember from primary school that was banned or was a bigger craze than anything that I added in the video, don't forget to write in the comments below. And also, don't forget to smack that like button and subscribe to my channel so you can stay up to date with every video that I bring out every week. Um, if there's anything in particular that you would like me to talk about, write it in the comments below and I'll see you guys next week.